Uh, we, we, we're running out of time, believe it or not. Um, I'm going to quick, quick fire a couple of questions. Uh, Someone here, Chicky. Uh, the the Ben Names question. Um, is Ben here still? Oh. Anyway, the Ben Names question. Um, you, uh, you have studios on fire. You, uh, you, you, you lock up some fire with all your kit in it. You can run it, you can grab one item. What are you going to grab? I thought about this one now. <laughs> Hard drives. Okay. Hard drives. Uh, it'd be only because. I can replace all the kit, but you know, that, that means it's lost. It's gone for Okay, Dave? HT25 effect bonus. HT25, so much is this? Yeah, absolutely. There you go. It's so much better, please. Rock, I'm holding the bills. But actually, the truth is, in my, in my, I have a real studio at home, and the thing that I would grab out of my studio is uh, the game guitar I bought when I was 18 years old. Oh. Ben, beat that! <laughs> well, mine's, mine's cramped, it's a microphone, A2500. Right. Drop kick it, anything that sounds right. <laughs> okay. And, um, last question. Yeah? I get this the mom telling me. Um, last question. Um, uh, what's the crappiest gig you've ever played? <laughs> <laughs> Anyone? <laughs> we want names. We want to thank you. The, the, the tour I, I like the least um, of all of the tours I've ever done, and I've done a few, um, and um, nothing personal, but the tour I hated the most was the Goldie tour. Right. Because that music just went on and on and on. <laughs> and there, there was. <laughs> it was Jungle with Jungle. Then you like 20 minutes of Jungle. Five minutes when Jungle was. Just like anyway, for some reason, some fool decided that I should go and mix that. So, uh, Roldy was running at the end of the night after four hours of Jungle DJ. God, and it felt like there was about four records that they all just played over and over and over and over again. Yeah. And then they go backstage and high five each other and go, "Great set, man." <laughs> well, we just played the same four records for an hour. <laughs> um, yeah. So that. Was, well, okay. Yeah. Anybody else like to contribute? to the, 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 the bowels of hell and, and the experience. Belgrade calling Serbia two years ago with Ugly Kid Joe and we turned up and specced our risers which the local crew then pulled some pallets apart and built them and as line check started they wheeled our drums on the stage and the riser split in the middle and the entire kit fell in um, and then that was followed by they ran out of XLR cables so we couldn't, we didn't have a vocal till the second song. And then the first show, who was horse, which we didn't know until after. Well, we're always in an outback. So, I kind of think after that, that's too much. Okay. <laughs> what's, it, what's, it, what's it like being with Adele? Not suggesting that her shows are in any way. Um, uh, I, I would rather punch, punch myself in the face and go in to see her. But, uh, uh, it's, it's very, very professional. Um, long sign checks we get for every song in the day. Really? Um, yeah, she, she attention to detail. Right. Um, but a real joy to work with, you know, a, a proper human being. Yeah. Balanced. Very good. Yeah. Yeah. And, and Chicky? Um, so, uh, I think I'm used to this one last time. So, probably that gig, I think I told you about the... Um, with the Russian. The Russian. Right. Yeah. Tell us again, so, for those who weren't here. How many of you were here last time? Okay. They want, they want okay, to sorry, good, good, sorry. Anyway, so yeah, uh, I did this gig in, in Russia with Grace Jones, and we've been shown around town by this Russian oligarch who's very, very friendly, very uh, very giving of his time and, and so forth. He wasn't very giving of the money on time, which Grace <laughs> insists on being paid before a show, for, because that's sort of how all her, her role works. And he was taking his time, paying, and... and you know, the audience was wanting us to go on, and, and she, was, she wasn't going to do it. And so finally, he brought the money to her, and then she thought, well, okay, well, I'll pour myself some more champagne, and I'll make the audience wait a little longer, because he made me wait, so I'll make him wait for a while. <laughs> and that went on for a while, and this audience is just going ballistic. You know, these angry Russians are just freaking out that she's not going on stage. And so he comes up to me. I'm standing you know, by her dressing room, because, and he goes, uh... You can tell Miss Grace Jones she can go on stage. 
Or I send someone to break her legs. I don't care which one. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I booked it. I was like, Grace, start the music. And I ran back out of that. started, you know, because all my laptop is there, that kind of show. Start the music. She runs out the hula hoop and just starts performing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a nightmare cake. Okay. So, um, thank you. Thank you, Chicky. Oh, I forgot about the breaking legs, but yes, it was worth taking again.